Voyager 1 is the farthest object ever made by humans. Since 1977, it has traveled over 14 billion miles from Earth. It was launched more than 40 years ago and has never stopped moving. It now travels in the deep, cold, and silent parts of space. In 2012, it reached a historic moment by entering interstellar space. This means it crossed beyond the heliosphere. The heliosphere is like a bubble around our solar system made by the sun's solar wind. Once Voyager 1 passed that, it became the first spacecraft to leave the sun's influence. This was a huge step for science and space exploration. What makes this even more amazing is the simple technology it carries. Voyager 1 was built using 1970s technology. Its computer is weaker than a basic modern calculator. Despite that, it still sends signals back to Earth after all these years. This shows how carefully it was built by engineers who planned for the long term. Its first job was to study Jupiter and Saturn. After completing that, it kept going instead of stopping. As it passed Jupiter, it sent back photos and data that showed giant storms and volcanic eruptions on Jupiter's moon Io. It later flew by Saturn and discovered new things like a giant hexagon-shaped storm near its North Pole. These were things no one had seen before. After passing Saturn, Voyager 1 entered deep space. No spacecraft had ever gone that far before. It communicates using a tiny 23-watt transmitter. That's less power than a small night light. Still, its messages travel billions of miles across space. These signals take over 21 hours to reach Earth. This helps us understand how truly large space is. Even the fastest things take time to move across such distances. Voyager 1 also carries something special called the Golden Record. This was made for any intelligent life that might find it one day. The record has greetings in 55 different languages from people on Earth. It also includes sounds like birds singing, ocean waves, thunder, and even a human heartbeat. There's also music from many cultures around the world. This was meant to show Earth's diversity and human creativity. The record sends a peaceful message to the universe. It tells whoever finds it about our planet and who we are. Voyager 1's journey was only possible because of a rare alignment of the planets. This allowed it to use gravity from planets like Jupiter and Saturn to gain speed. These gravity assists helped it move faster without using more fuel. Without this smart idea, the mission would have taken much longer. With this help, Voyager 1 made big discoveries, including volcanic activity and strange weather systems. It also helped us learn more about Neptune's moon Triton, where it found signs of nitrogen geysers. These findings changed what we know about outer planets. Voyager 1 has a twin called Voyager 2. Voyager 2 is also still active today. Voyager 2 is the only spacecraft to visit Uranus and Neptune. These two spacecraft together helped reshape our understanding of the solar system. They showed us things we never imagined. Even now, Voyager 1 is helping scientists learn new things. Recently, it detected a faint humming noise in interstellar space. Scientists think this comes from tiny vibrations in gas between the stars. These sounds are very soft, like whispers coming from far away. Even after all these years, Voyager 1 continues to surprise us. The spacecraft only has 69 kilobytes of memory. That's less than a single photo taken by your phone. It's powered by a small nuclear battery. This battery works by turning heat from decaying plutonium into electricity. It was expected to last until 2025, but Voyager 1 is still working. This shows how strong and well-designed it is. Even after its power runs out, Voyager 1 will keep floating through space for thousands of years. It will carry the golden record with it continuing to share Earth's message long after we are gone. Along its journey, it has captured beautiful images and helped uncover the secrets of space. It showed us lightning on Jupiter and unique storms on Saturn. When it crossed the heliosphere, it wasn't an instant moment. Scientists used data on particles and cosmic rays to confirm the change. They noticed that the magnetic field direction didn't change much. 
This suggests that the sun's influence might reach farther than we thought. Voyager 1 faces extreme cold, radiation, and the test of time. But because of its simple and strong design, it keeps going. With fewer moving parts, there's less chance for something to break. This is an important lesson for future space missions. Every signal it sends is like a whisper from the edge of space. NASA uses large antennas on Earth to catch these faint signals. These antennas are part of the Deep Space Network, which listens closely for information from far away. It's like trying to hear a tiny drop of water in a thunderstorm. Yet, even these tiny messages tell us important things. The Voyager mission originally cost around $865 million. Today, that would be about $4 billion. For that cost, we've received over 40 years of valuable data and insight into the universe. Voyager 1 is still moving through space at around 38,000 miles per hour. But even at that speed, it would take more than 73,000 years to reach the closest star. One day, it will enter the Oort cloud, a distant area full of icy objects. It will take 300 years to enter this region and 30,000 years to pass through it. While it moves silently through space, it carries a piece of humanity with it. But human curiosity and imagination know no limits. It shows that even something built decades ago can keep making history. It teaches us to keep asking questions and exploring the unknown. Subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.